Hello, we're Sports and Touring. We're Jaguar F-Type specialists, and it is my huge pleasure to show you this beautiful F-Type V8R in Stratus Grey on 20-inch Gyrodyne wheels. If Jaguar had got the F-Type wrong, it could have cost the company its reputation. And that is why so much effort was put in at every stage in taking this car, which has its heritage, its roots, its design principles deep, within the DNA of Jaguar Land Rover and emerged as a truly world-class and world-beating sports car. The combination of stunning looks, amazing performance, practicality of ownership, I dare say, and the driving pleasure which it delivers behind the wheel while still being a car which you don't feel self-conscious in. It's a car you can park in the supermarket car park without worrying. You can't say that for all modern sports cars. And all of that adds up to just the most tremendous package for the F-Type owner. And then we have an example like this. It's a stunning car which has flown through our technical inspections. It's got great service history. Everything is functioning exactly as it should. And it's a huge pleasure to have it here at Trinley. Let's take a look inside. The car's supplied, of course, with the original owner's book pack and two remote key fobs. Uh, this one in my hand with the growler key ring. The other one has a leaper key ring. But no need to be holding the key fob in your hand in order to get in because amongst the options on this particular car is keyless entry. There's the little button, press that. The handle pops out, the power fold mirror deploys and we can get into the car. And what beautiful condition. The door card, pretty well unblemished as it left the factory. Beautiful condition in black with the red stitching to match the black seats with red inserts again with this beautiful stitching setting off the leather. There's the R logo on the headrests. And everything about this cockpit just in beautiful condition. The dashboard, the centre console, the floor mats, everything really very good indeed. Speaking of options, well, there's the little badge telling us we have Meridian surround sound. We've got the full multi-way electric memory seat package. If we just look down here on the mirror, we can see the display for the blind spot information system, a very useful safety feature. And sitting down into an F-Type, always a special experience. Here in the R, of course, we've got the R badge there reminding us that we are in the proper V8 supercharged version of the car. And looking around, well, uh, above there is the panoramic sunroof with the sliding cover for days when it gets too hot and bright. Centre console here with USB and 12 volt sockets there. Twin cup holders for your refreshments. In the middle here, we've got the buttons for Eco Stop Start to deploy the rear spoiler. We've got the traction control on off and the switched active sports exhaust button to open the exhaust valves when we want to. There's the beautiful shift stick. It looks like something out of a fighter aircraft, doesn't it? With that trigger on the front so that we can select reverse, neutral and drive. And of course, with the engine running, we can pop it sideways into sports mode as well. So there are two gearbox modes, drive and sports. And similarly, there are three driving modes, normal, and then we move the paddle switch back for dynamic and forward for ice, rain and snow. Then we've got the climate controls and the multifunction infotainment system. Over here on the steering wheel, we've got, of course, the flappy paddles for gear shifting, multifunction controls and Bluetooth telephony on the left. Over on the right, the cruise control and speed limiter and the button for the heated steering wheel. And until you've lived with a heated steering wheel through a British winter, I don't think you've re really experienced pleasure. Um, again, we've got uh, automatic headlamps and rain sensitive wipers and that beautiful instrument binnacle there with the big speedometer and rev counter. Let's start the engine and we'll watch the little flying display on the instrument panel and then we will see the centre vents rise up from their stowed position as well while we listen to the fabulous soundtrack from this V8. There we 
we are. The engine over revs for a few moments in order to protect the catalytic converter on start. The vents have popped up, the infotainment is coming to life. And I'll close the door just to keep the sound down. What a beautiful place to be. The climate control, we have dual zone, so you and your passenger can have your own temperatures. And we've got the very desirable electrically heated front windscreen option on this car. Again, supremely, supremely useful in British winter weather when the screen is iced up. Infotainment here, and we've got the home screen from which we can navigate to audio, telephony, climate control and satellite navigation and the buttons around the side achieve the same ends. There's the sat-nav screen. There isn't a phone connected at the moment, but you can see it's Bluetooth and it works superbly. The media functions, we've got FM, radio, DAB. We've got uh, my music options in this car, which uh, include Bluetooth audio, as you see there on the screen. So you can stream music from your phone and that lovely centre vent which pops up to ensure the airflow through the cockpit is as you need it to be. And there is the instrument binnacle. Selecting dynamic mode, by the way, turns the instrument panel red and reminds you that you're now in full-on dynamic driving mode. A great place to be, and in this F-Type, in stunning condition too. It really is a very impressive example of this sports car. Looking at the passenger side of the car. And there, by the way, the illuminated sill plates on this Jaguar, which light up the logo. And again, a perfect door card. A beautiful interior, a seat which I dare say has very seldom seen an occupant. The leather in fabulous condition. The dashboard likewise. And there's the button, by the way for the glove box, handy stowage in there. Everything in truly impressive condition. Among the other very desirable options on this F-Type is the powered tailgate. Press the button on the key fob and up it goes. And although a lot of sports cars sacrifice boot space for engineering reasons or aesthetic reasons, the F-Type still manages to offer plentiful room as long as you avoid hard suitcases and stick with soft travelling bags, there's plenty of space here, which extends out right behind the rear wheel arches, by the way, to get enough bags in for two or three weeks away. Friends of mine have toured the north of Italy and had extended holidays uh, in F-types with no difficulties at all, as long as you pack soft bags and pack sensibly. You can, by the way, get bespoke designed luggage sets which fit in an F-Type boot and they are probably the very best solution if you're going to holiday in your F-Type. Again, to close the boot, just press the button there. Down it goes and latches in position. And while we're here at the back of the car alongside the R badge of course and the AWD badge marking that this is a four-wheel drive version of the F-Type, here are those beautiful twin tailpipes on each side of the car adding up to a quad exhaust system which looks and sounds really amazing. Under the bonnet and there is Jaguar's V8 supercharged power plant producing 542 brake horsepower. And through the all-wheel drive system and the eight-speed gearbox with those flappy paddles, which give you manual intervention whenever you want it without taking your hands off the steering wheel. Uh, this car is propelled from 0 to 60 in just 3.9 thrilling seconds and on to a top speed of 186 miles an hour. And impressive those those figures are, they're not really what the F-Type is about. The F-Type is about the engagement that it gives to the driver. It's about the sense of being connected with the machine and in touch with the road. It's about the way that it communicates and delivers pleasure as you drive, whether you're just dawdling down to the shops or pushing hard on a hilly road with bends and overtakes. It's a thrilling experience to be behind the wheel of an F-Type. And that's one of the principal reasons why we are so pleased to specialise in these amazing British cars. 
So many thanks for watching. My name is Tim, my company is Sports and Touring. We're just outside Andover in Hampshire. We're open seven days a week by appointment only. You're very welcome to WhatsApp, email or telephone us if you'd like to see this car in person or by video call. If you've got a car you need to dispose of, we'll give you frank and honest advice about the best way to achieve the maximum value at the minimum inconvenience, whether by part exchange, selling privately or whatever. And if you need to chat about finance, we can do that too. We're authorised and regulated by the FCA. Please take a few moments to have a look at our reviews on Autotrader. We're very proud of what we've achieved and I do look forward to hearing from you shortly.